Hey, what's going on, everybody? Uh, we'll be setting up and knocking down a pretty quiet weather day, breezy to windy, especially up and down the Front Range and Swatch Mountains. Could get some pretty gusty winds later today, but uh, everybody should be dry for a while. Uh, some chances of showers, maybe some, maybe mountain snow a couple of times next week, but a lot of uncertainty that far out. Was uh, mostly clear beauty of a night last night looking at that webcam view from Loveland Ski. This is new if uh, maybe you're a photographer, you love photography out there, you take a photo, some beautiful scenery, some impactful weather. Be safe if you take photos during that. Eventually, when we get another round of maybe some high elevation and ski resort snow, you can snap a photo, send it in. Uh, you can email it, email address right in the middle of your screen there, whether at mnt mtn-tv.com or uh, you can go to the handle mtntvco. We'll be on the lookout. One of your photos may be uh, featured on a forecast in the future. Precip forecast through Friday. Big goose egg nothing for everybody. And that's even with a uh, front that's set up shop pretty much north to south oriented uh, right up and down the mountains, middle of Colorado. There's a front there. I'm not going to see any showers, some clouds popping up on satellite view and eyeball view at times. But uh, overall, a lot of us will be mostly sunny today with a moderate northwest wind. High temperature is still well above average. 72 in Denver today, 77 Cortez. Aspen, Crested Butte, Vail, Steamboat in the ranks of the low to mid 60s. 65 in Aspen, that's about 11 degrees above average for you. So the calendar says October 18th, mid-October. Uh, weather has warm different plans. Overnight tonight, 29 in Steamboat, 35 in Aspen, a frosted 27 in Crested Butte. Our wind gusts will be around the 15 to 30 mile per hour range. Some gusts could get over 50 miles per hour, might even much higher than that. In the high elevations though, up and down the front range and the Sawatch range will have that best chance of uh, winds really picking up. A lot of thick clouds to our southeast, and then from the north, some high and mid-level clouds drop in, but uh, I'm not expecting any showers to fall underneath any passing clouds for anybody today. Just add a little extra personality to the sky. Denver 72, we're at 80 in Denver tomorrow. A couple of days in the low 80s, topping out near 82 on Friday. Rocky Mountain National Park near 63, steamboat about the same over at Eldora, got you at 53 today. Dry for the next five days. Steamboat Springs 72 for your high on Friday. We're getting even warmer yet this week. Aspen 65, Beaver Creek heavy near 57 today. Oh yeah, Vale and Aspen, you'll make runs at the low 70s maybe for two or three days to finish out the week. Around Summit County, Breckenridge 57, Loveland Ski at 44, Breckenridge mid 60s, Route 66 for your high temp on Friday. And yeah, you bet we're going to be warm to the southwest as well. Dry for the next five. Now for mountain traffic.